Dieu de bon Dieu, oh boss. It hurts. It hurts. Sting yourself, Claude. Just be thankful you got out alive. I'm still in pretty bad shape. Et puis quoi? Don't you think it was worth it? This tunnel is a gold mine. With what we've managed to gather, we'll be set for a long time. Monsieur. Huh? Who goes there? Oh, so let's get the hell out of here. Run, Claude. Run if you can. Oh, my lord. I told you we'd get caught. Lotus from the observatory. Poor souls. They didn't stand a chance. Fortunately, they are in perfect condition. Monsieur Bailly will be delighted.
Monsieur Bailly. Here are the blueprints you asked for. Good heavens. You found them. Your thieves were not able to profit much from their theft. They met with an unfortunate end. Oh, the poor souls. Their crimes did not deserve such a permanent ending. Certainly, certainly. Let us look at these documents now, if you will. No, Antoine, the F-Wheel is not part of the cog that transfers the driving force to the escapement. Diable, you're right. It's driven by the B-Wheel, and its axis is on the shaft that's visible at this point. Precisely. In fact, the shaft sits between the conical bearing and the small groove here. See? True. It's decided, then. All we would have to do is separate these two plates to disable the entire thing. And to put them back in place at the agreed time to start the machine again. You will not be able to assist me. I have to do it alone. Half a league away. You must be joking. By no means. You'll have to find another solution. Unfortunately, madame, you're asking us to do the impossible. Oh, ça, par exemple. Once your spirit is untethered from this automat, it will be impossible for you to start the machine up again. Hold on, my dear Antoine. Is this device in figure four? Is it still in place? Hmm. Yes, it is. What of it? Bon sang. It's a timer. It's primitive, true, but fully functional. The dial has marks from one to fifteen. Probably minutes. It was to allow Eugène to plan the duration of Ludia's dances in advance. Oh, I see. And by reversing the position of this peg in the center, we could instead turn it into a period of inactivity. Nous y sommes, mon ami. Fantastic. Will Aegis be able to operate this device herself? We'll make it easier for her. All you have to do is put a bolt there that she can remove when the time is right. Yes, a small iron rod will suffice. We won't have any trouble finding something that will do. When the timer dial reaches zero, the automat will come back to life. However, given the dial's fragility, we will probably get only one chance to try this. Are you sure that the bond between my soul and this machine will be re-established? Ma foi, I admit that we can't be sure of this. What do you say, mon père? Don't be afraid, Aegis. Unless I've been wrong from the beginning, your soul will seek refuge in the only body it has available to it in this world. Well then, shall we start the preparations? Let's begin. My fate is in your hands, monsieur. Voila. Everything is in place. When it's time, just pull on this metal loop to start the timer. Remember, you will have 15 minutes and no more before your spirit returns to your body. We wish you good luck, madame. Remember, to get to Rue de Montmorency, you're best going through the cemetery behind the Église Saint-Jacques in the Quartier de l'Hôtel de Ville. Here is the key to the gate. Our prayers are with you, my child. <laughs>